And, you know, whilst I'm doing that, obviously, I'll be taking out people in Europe. Um, but, yeah, until until I take out America, this uh, until I take out the whole of America as a continent, uh, or Southern and Northern America as continents, then I will continue this Let's Play. But until then, uh, yeah, once I've done that, I will probably... Oh, crap, I probably should have reinforced my men. Let's meet up the cannons, I guess. That's some epic music as well. Just looking over at the, the Star Fort. I think this is the first time I've actually fought in a Star Fort. Just our men ready to go. Light infantry ready. Cannons are moving up in our amazing formation. I want to have a better formation. We'll have two waves of... Are they shooting cannons at me? They better not be, or else. Just gonna play on triple speed just while they get into position. They have a lot of cav in this army as well, which is nice. Oh, this is really good. Uh, Philadelphian-like cav. They look so cool with their, their orangish coats. Got my general over here. Let's go ahead and form him up a little bit better. My general's bodyguard over here. Cannons are in position. They are shooting cannons at me. How ungrateful. I mean, I wasn't going to shoot my cannons at them if they didn't shoot their cannons at me, but for some reason they have decided to start shooting their cannons at me, so that's just pretty snow. We also got some horses in the, over here, which is probably quite cool. We've got some dragoons as well, so they can just mount and give the enemy hell. They're going to remain hidden as well, which is cool. Can these guys move without still being hidden? They can't, so let's go ahead and just turn that. Our cannon line. I want to do that so that they just reload and don't actually shoot at anything. They actually hit me over here. I told you guys not to fire, but you fired anyway. Oh, the devastation. That house just took a pounding. Let's go ahead and hit this all. they got so many men over here. But we'll go ahead and hit this wall, I think, will be the main idea. Our cannons will literally just absolutely destroy this wall. They have a lot of men here, which is kind of sad. Like, look at these. They already have, like, so many men. This big clump as well. Just, it's the entire way down. It's just, but it's, to be fair, it's all only just militia. They have some red coats over here, but apart from that, like, they're pretty... Cannon shots are coming in. Oh, are they coming in? That was, I swear that's a really, really poor volley of cannon shots. Yeah, apparently they did. So we just need to hope to be hurt the wall at all. We did not hurt the wall at whatsoever. I want that wall down. That's going to be my main place I attack. There we go, that was better. 19% already. That's what we want. Keep it up. As soon as that wall's breached, I will move up the first the first line of infantry. Maybe rush some cav through as well, uh, just to help out. And once that's done, we'll start hitting this big bulk of infantry over there. But I want to get this wall down. It's already down to 42%, which is nice. Yeah, I want to have a nice, nice siege. It should be down. Yeah, it's already hurting. It's already killed a few men, actually, as well. Something I, I really, like, was upset that they didn't add in. Like, once you destroy this wall, what it should be like, it should be like this. You should have to go run up the wall uh, once the wall is destroyed. Like, you should be able to just run up the wall and, like, fight on the walls for it. Like, they're doing, like, sharp and TV programs like that. Like, if you had to, like, you send the fallen hope up the wall and stuff like that. Like, it would be so cool. I think it would make Empire a much, much better game. But alas, they didn't do that. I hope they do something like that in Rome. Like, I, I, I'm kind of scared that they won't. Well, I'm not scared. Uh, but I'm, I, I pretty much just assume that they won't do it. But, like, like here, once you've destroyed the wall here, you should be able to just, like, march off it. But they didn't do that, which was really, really sad. Let's hit these dudes with carcass shot as well. I'll just absolutely slaughter them on that wall. They're already shooting carcass shot. That should, if it hits, that should just kill everyone there. That house is just burning now. Well, it did hit over here, but it didn't really kill anyone, which is sad. Uh, it killed quite a few people, actually, to be fair. Yeah, it did kill quite a few people. 
send a carcass shot in here. Let's see if we can actually hit them from in here. And then we'll, we'll send forward all leaders, all muskets. If that hurts. Oh, the massacre. I didn't even hurt. That killed a lot of people. I lied. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and go to explosive shells and hit over here. See that, what, that, how much damage that does. And this entire time, we'll go ahead and move up our first line of our brave, brave infantry. Oh, they are not. Oh, whoa! No, no, no! I pressed W. Fuck! My, my bad. My bad. Holy crap! I was like, why are they routing? Why are they routing? And I realised I pressed W, which is the withdraw sign. I was holding down control and then pressed W. So let's go ahead and move these dudes up. The explosive shell didn't really go too well. I don't think I really killed anyone. We actually have a gate here as well. Who needs gates when you have cannons? Let's go ahead and just be hitting this line, I guess, with carcass shell as much as possible. Whilst our infantry does move up. Oh, that was devastating if that would have killed some people. It always looks like it like it did like a really, really good job and killed so many people when it, it really didn't. Which is sad. Our infantry is marching up. Actually just hurting this wall quite a bit as well. Which is good. Just keep on moving up this infantry. We'll move up the infantry like up to here. Oh no, we got some cav selected. No, fuck. I keep on pressing W. I keep on holding down W, I should say. Whilst I'm trying to select people with control. Oh, a lot of infantry can go up as well. I can scale these walls. Oh, that is devastating here. It's holy crap. We are hurting them massively over there. That is some devastating cannon fire. Let's keep on moving up this infantry. This infantry is almost in range just to stop piling on the pressure over there. Gun stick these dudes on normal motion. I would only get them to fire as well when I am ready for them to fire. Oh crap, hold your ground! Hold the ground! Prepare the melee! Charge! 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 Open fire! If these guys open fire on the cone and say, oh, come charging him, that should be deadly. We've got some men over here getting ready to... Deadly at there, they're just going to fire into the side and that's just going to be devastating. I'll get these guys to climb their walls over there. They should just not stand a chance. Cannon fire can change in case I hit my men. Uh, yeah, we can actually start, we can't actually hit any of them men over here. Let's just start hitting these men. We've got some live shoot climbing the walls over here. We'll just be hitting that wall, that's fine. They're charging so many men out, out at me. Goddamn British. We are actually moving up the men over here, but as soon as these guys get on the wall, they should be able to do a nice job over there. Their men are just all routing. Charge them down. Yeah, this is the thing. The odds might have been in their favour, like, relatively, like, a lot. But they, they saw them in a militia, like, they're not going to stand up against some really really nice American troops like there's just no way they can do it charge in boys for the unknown glory of the Empire you are free men and we shall keep being free through the musket and making other people not free let's get them off from a wall make and start shooting these dudes These guys get up on the wall. For our own glory. I don't want you guys just to run at them. I want you just to shoot them. Uh, yeah, just keep on moving in. We've got men over here getting ready to start getting into heavy core, like heavy melee. Big old clusterfuck of men over here. <laughs> 
slow mo that shit. Just our We've got some grenadiers here as well, which will just hopefully just absolutely pour in. Oh, no, I don't want to put all my army melee. Probably should go ahead and take them off melee. Yeah, you guys don't have to be melee. I'll let you off this one time. Let's go ahead and move in the cab as well. Why not? That wall is just absolutely just, just on fire. Yeah, men over here, which is beautiful. Fighting these uh, armed civilians. Oh, some of their men actually came back. That's cute. Doing a good job in the melee, though. We are pushing them back. That's brilliant. That's really, really good. Horses over there are moving. I'm going to go ahead and grab my phone whilst the action is going on. I'll zoom in, though, so you guys don't have to sit in silence for a while. Guys, I'm back. Just had to grab my phone uh, to make sure I haven't missed anything. Uh, like I was obviously texting my girlfriend. Don't want to leave her hanging for too long. So yeah, we're just pushing through this gap. There's so many men here, which is really, really awesome. Uh, but as soon as I've climbed up these walls, I can start volleying down. And as soon as I can do that, like they don't stand a chance. The carcass shot is kind of wasted, I guess, over here. Let's go ahead and just go back to normal cannon shot, and we'll just start hitting that unit of infantry. We just need to hurry up and win up here and kill these men and then form up and just start pounding. As soon as that happens, like, they, they stand no chance. We just need to speed things up so that happens. Okay, it's lagging way too much on that speed. I don't know why. It is lagging. Okay, that's all done now. Let's go ahead and form up. Hopefully these guys can form up and we can just start firing the musket down. They just gonna carry on going. Look how many men we kill with a carcass shot. So many. Yeah, they just gonna keep on going. So let's just charge down and hopefully we can get into their flanks. Now just carry on pushing forward. Come on, men. You can do it. That's all beautiful. A cannon shot's actually hitting these. We actually got a nice hit here. We killed like six or seven men. That's awesome. They actually have some mortars, is it? Yeah, they actually do have mortars. They don't really have many crews left though. Which is kind of funny. Yeah, some infantry retreating over there. Which is fine. How are we doing over here? Cannons are still just shooting. Yeah, we just need to keep on pounding away with our cannons. Like, yeah, look at... Look at London burn. It was London in the distance. This is one thing that also like really annoyed me. There was no sort of like cities in the surrounding area. Like, why would you need to take out this staff war? You just march into London and just kill it. <laughs> like, just say we are now in charge of London and just surround this fort, like, and just starve them out. But yeah, but like, I don't know. What even is this? I guess it's supposed to be oh, the cannon, and it is lagging a little bit as well. I don't know why it's lagging so much, like, why is this lagging? My computer can run it absolutely fine normally. Uh, I'm probably just going to go ahead and stop and start recording, maybe that will help it out. Okay guys, so I think I might sort it out. Basically it wasn't actually my screen resolution, it was um, there's some weird ass screen resolution which obviously wasn't mine. Uh, it's still lagging a little bit. Yeah, it's still really jumpy, okay, maybe it wasn't my screen resolution. Um, this is kind of annoying, I'm not quite sure why it's doing it. Normally when I play Empire by myself, like, and, oh, obviously I don't record with it, but still. I was doing this issue when I wasn't recording, just now. Which is kind of super annoying. Uh, I guess because it's just got so many men cluster fucking, uh, it's just being a little bit, uh, laggy. Let's go ahead and just move up the rest of our, our cab, hopefully we can just march straight through, that would be nice if we could. Play on triple speed just a little bit, just whilst the cab. Uh, get their asses in gear and decide to charge. They are running as well. Yeah, we, I don't think we can really play on triple speed that much because it's just lagging. I'm not quite sure why it is. My laptop should run this game absolutely fine and record absolutely fine. But normally when I play by my... Like, yeah, as I was saying, normally when I play it, it just runs absolutely fine. But I guess because there are so many men just all cluster fucked into one small area. 
like, there's so many men here. It's just, like, yeah, it's just struggling to run it all, I guess. But there's a good, like, 2,000 men all in this small, small-ass place. Should I risk it? Should I just cluster? Should I just kind of, I mean, should I carcass shot it and see how, how many of my own men I kill? Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh my god, this is really bad. Let's try to get the furthest back unit. See how many of, men I, of my own men I actually kill. This could be the best, my best idea or my worst idea. That wasn't good. I could kill a lot of my own men. If I get a decent hit, that's just going to kill this entire bunch. But that's if I kill, get a decent hit. Oh, no, that's not good. I just killed a lot of my own men. Yeah, that was not my best idea. Let's go ahead and tell these guys to stop firing. There's nothing really I can really use them for anymore. Let's go ahead and limber them up. Okay, so I just killed a lot of my own men. The cab can hopefully just power through now, though. Let's go and march up these guys. They can just start climbing these walls. Split them up a little bit. You know, these two can go over here. These two can just go ahead and uh, climb. What can we climb? Let's climb up these walls, I guess, and we'll just march down here and just outflank them. I can't believe how many men I just killed. I just slaughtered my entire first fall on hope. I guess I got called a fall on hope for a reason though, so. Can they shoot down there? Hopefully they can. Why do that? Maybe they're hoping they can start shooting over. Because they can. No, they can't, technically, see. Into the bridge, man! Oh, they probably can now, though. Hopefully, that'll be devastating if they can. Please say you can shoot. No, you guys can't. How sad. I'll just tell them to click on it anyway. B and Tree are moving up double time. I've thrown away so many men just with that carcass shot. I only just killed like hundreds of my own men. Can they just power their way through or not? They can't by the looks of it. Well, they are actually doing it. They're pushing their way forward. Some of them are actually getting through. What happens if I spam click it? Do you think I can get through? Yeah, there you go. Power through, horses. Power through. They got, they just broke up that line so, oh my god, I lost so many horses here. Yes, beautiful, beautiful. Let's go ahead and, oh, they're routing now, that's not good. That's not good at all. Let's go ahead and just form up there. Some of the horses made it at least, let's go ahead and stop these cannons from firing. Oh crap, they are running out at me. They want some they wanna fight now. But at least we hold the city centre. As long as we hold no, they're moving in some men in to stop it. It's only militia though. For our own glory, man, if we kill the militia, the rest of their forces are pretty caught up over here. If we can, I'd like to just form up retreat back and form up a decent line, man, that'd be nice. Still can't believe that carcass shot. It could have gone extremely well for me, though. In all fairness, like it was either going to go really well or really bad, and it just happened to go really bad. How are we doing over here? We are actually killing this militia really well, so that's lovely. We can hopefully hold this city center. If they can, let's have them firing on the enemy. That's if they can. I don't know where that army's going, but I'll just let it move. Beautiful. Yeah, as soon as I, I moved that, the big old clump of fucking, like, 2,000 men there, it seems to be running a little bit better. Yeah, it seems to be running a lot better. I guess it was just that massive, like, clump of, like, I had so many men there. It was probably over 2,000 men in such a small, uh, small place, but the engine probably was just struggling holding it or something. 
Uh, okay, cool. Yeah, we've taken this bit of the city centre as ours, hopefully. When we kill that bit, the uh, timer should carry on going. These guys are just volleying into these dudes back. Dude, they're just going to route. Okay, let's go ahead and stop pushing forward. Actually, no, let's, let's form up the line again. And then just volley into it. Like, the melee wasn't really in our favour. We were kind of losing it. We weren't really going anywhere. These guys have, like, no men left now. It's just a matter of time till they all die. Yes, they are outing. The timer should carry on going. End battle. Huzzah. Heroic victory. Brilliant. God, I, can't, I still can't believe how many of my men I killed with that carcass shot. It was either going to go really well or really bad. It just happened that the shots fell on my side of the wall instead of theirs. So it could have happened to anyone. Could have happened to anyone. Hopefully, I won't. This general won't be remembered for that, though. He'll be remembered for taking the uh, the United Kingdom. Uh, I lost. I mean, look, way lost a lot of men. Three. They had three thousand men. That is crazy. So yeah, now we own this. Let's go ahead and repair everything. We kind of fucked it up with our carcass shots, and we just burnt everything. Let's go ahead and repair it all. They have some really nice like infantry bays and stuff like that. Uh, what I want to do, though, oh, let's merge everyone. Actually, let's go ahead and repair everyone asap. Yeah, everyone can get repaired. Then I want to move on Edinburgh as soon as possible. As soon as physically possible, I just want to go on Edinburgh and take him out. So I don't have to actually fight in here any longer. Uh, but I'm probably going to end the episode now because uh, we've done relatively quite a bit. We've lost the battle over here, which is sad. Uh, we have yeah, the, the Cherokee Nation are showing me that they're not ones to be messed with, which is uh, kind of sad and it's annoying because it's really, really hard. Um, but they will, they will kneel to the the uh empire which is the united um, the united states um yeah so next time we're gonna hopefully just bring on the pressure and kill out these dudes and just take the rest of the united kingdoms so yeah i hope you enjoyed this if you did leave a comment give, leave a like uh if you comment on the video it just shows me you guys want to see more and it, it does help motivate me seeing nice comments really does help motivate me to make more videos um i'm probably gonna i'm hopefully i don't know if i can have time it's almost half five already uh, I kind of got up a bit late. Um, I'm going to try and record some more Rome, but I'm not sure how that's going to go. If not, I will definitely record Mountain Blade tomorrow. Uh, hopefully, fingers crossed. I mean, I do have work tomorrow, so I don't know. But I will try my best. So, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. And fish out.